This behind me is the Columbia River here at Walla Walla Point Park. And as you can see, it's totally come up over the path behind me, as well as over the walking bridge. In fact, it's flowing over like a fast moving creek or river right now. And the PUD says this situation is going to get much worse before it gets better. Well, the water is definitely higher than normal, so uh, something we're concerned about and definitely concerned about uh, our park patrons' safety. So that's why we wanted to talk with you about that today. And one thing people need to keep in mind is, you know, we've had a lot of nice weather, hot weather, and people want to get to the water. We live by a beautiful body of water. It's a draw, but it, there's a lot of dangers involved in this high water. Absolutely. Our parks are a great place to come out and recreate, but when we see this high water and you see the safety signage and ribbon behind you, we just want to, uh, folks to know that we're concerned for their safety. And if it is marked as closed or we do have out ribbon, uh, we, we mean that. It's for your safety. And there's more dangers than just uh, high water. We're seeing some debris now that's come up from the water because it fluctuates so much and also some slippery banks and things like that, right? Absolutely. I don't know if you can see behind us here the bridge we have closed. There's debris stacking up on the north side of that. Uh, we also have debris that has come up into our lawn, which has been a challenge for, of course, uh, mowing. And yeah, we're concerned about whatever is in that debris for our uh, park patrons. So definitely need to be aware of it. So how long do you expect this to last then? I think that's a great question. You know, what I'm hearing is through the end of the month. Uh, of course, that's subject to Mother Nature and temperature. Uh, so yeah, we're, uh, we typically don't see the 90s this early, and that's led to uh, this runoff. And now we might have some rain in the forecast, possibly a thunderstorm with heavy rain, and that can't help either. That's right. You know, the more water you add, the, the higher it gets out here. So we just want to remind folks that, again, to, to keep out of these areas. There's reasons why we cordon them off, and, and we just really care about their safety. Many area residents I talked to today say they haven't seen flooding like this in decades. And PUD officials want to remind everyone that with our beautiful spring weather right now, everyone wants to get to the water, but pay attention to this red caution tape. Be safe and be alert. Grant Olson, NCW Life News.